men do not look happy. They were cost the titles, I'll say it, because of Rob Massey. But these men bring over 40 combined years of experience in the ring. 25 championships have been held between these men. That includes triple crown titles, international titles, tag team titles. Judge Chamber being the world representative of this group of next level grappling entertainment. But ever since he joined them, they have brought swift and complete justice here to the RWA. That is a lot of humanity in the ring. Oh God. I never get used to it IW dude. I will say this though, Judge Chambers might have the greatest beard ever. Tag won the RWA Tag Team Titles back in April Rain thanks to a review that was assisted by RWA broadcaster Rob Massey. I don't think this would have happened if I had been at the commentary table. I probably would have stopped him. I wasn't there. I started the next show. But these men defeated the International Men of Honor who are defending the titles a la the fabulous Freebirds. I was telling everybody how if I had been at the commentary table with you, I probably wouldn't have allowed you to do that review. For your own protection. Well, Judge Logan Chambers said nobody escapes justice, and I think he was directing that at me. Dante is very upset at me. Well, ever since uh, Judge Chambers joined the International Men of Honor, he's been a lot, doing a lot to help. He has helped uh, Chris Sterling get to the white side of the law. The what? I mean, the right side of the law. The right side of the law. Yes, the, the right, right side of the law. Right, with an R. I study. I stutter. Never going to get an NBA franchise. Never. A it's all the way to the West Coast, though. Do we really want to go to the West Coast? An it's alleged. Hot. It's hot there. I'm a big guy. I sweat. That's true. An alleged 3,734 and one quarter pounds. Was that like moon weight? That, that's what I was told. I mean, that you wonder who has a cape. He's flying. That's trainee 37. We know who trainee number one is. Yeah, and the small guy in the back is training number 143. So it's and training course, number 37 and 143. I, listen, I, I don't how know how big is training. this training school? They're very popular. The Matt cast is very popular. Uh, I mean, I listen to the Matt cast. But... Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors, where's your spot? May the fourth be with you. That is tomorrow. Star Wars Day tomorrow. This is why we don't have girlfriends. No. I'm happy for you, though, though. I'm happy for everybody. I'm happy everybody's happy. <laughs> it is going to be Dante taking on the Monster Mac. The bell has sounded, and we are underway. Rob, what are you going to do when Dante runs wild on the Monster Mac? I loved him in the AWA. Where is Freddie Blassie when you need him? The incredible Dante! And a headbutt. Nobody wins with a headbutt. He's not Simone. Big scoop! Oh! Now, oh, he's crazy. fighting him! Talk about taking a bite out of crime! Tell you, Dante is not happy. Canada just can't win today. First the Bruins, now this! Side Russian leg sweep. And here comes trainee number 140. What? 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 143. There's too many numbers! And he tags in trainee number 37. He's wearing a cape! He bought that with his loose change. Yes! Off the ropes goes Dante. And being planted with a double no! leg lift. And an elbow drop. The Monster Mac Academy. Here's a cover. One, two. The Monster Mac, the Mac attack. Looking really, really good as training number one now tags in 
the trainer and owner of the Mac Academy, the Monster Man. Do you think if that shield was gold, it would hold some sort of power to someone like Godzilla or a no, robot that looks like a it? dragon zord? He needs a flute. And he comes out of the water. Here comes Jack Logan Chambers. And he's got a head for justice, Rob. He does have a head for justice. And no. Oh! And that is that is not right. That is not PG. I've read about this in a book. A very gray book? I don't know. It was about 50 pages. Different shades of it, would you say? Something like that. Speaking of the West Coast, these guys want to be cowboys. Dude, there's no way that they can get their broke backs to that mountain. Who has more fun than us <laughs> as training number 143 is going to fly? Oh! Somersault plancha! This time it was a somersault plancha! You got it right, Rob! Yes! yes! And here comes oh! Monster Mac with a suicide dive. How is it the one without a cape is the one not flying? I don't think he flies. He's flying right now! I think he's only, like, taking one fall to the mat. He's losing his body! He had the momentum! I'm all excited! Training number 37. I want a cape! Is the cape I apologize, trainee. Coach. Now back into the ring. Mr. Sterling hammering training number one. You forgot to apologize at the beginning of the broadcast for the shenanigans that we're going to have. I did forget to apologize. Oh. And now Mr. Sterling trips up Monster Mac as the International Men of Honor and Miss Lynn tear into training number right. one. If you were in a dark alley with the International Man of Honor and Miss Lynn, which one would you be most afraid of? Miss Lynn. All right, just making sure. Yeah. It's, training it's, number one. It's off the ropes. Being caught. And the man of the suplexes for the belly-to-belly -belly suplex. For me, it's a tie between Miss Lynn and Dante's Miss Lynn. One, two, three. Eyes on that thing is huge. Yeah, here's a cover. One, two. And Mrs. Sterling who was the one involved in the original decision that was overturned. Excuse me, no, that was Judge Logan Chambers. Mr. Sterling was the one that was pinned. She says Dante Mr. is Sterling, being choked out. Mr. Sterling was on the white side, I mean, wrong side of the decision. Correct. All right. Irish Warrior now in the biggest member of the International Men of Honor. How would you know that? Oh, sorry. I'm in you're going to fire me, aren't you? Yes. I'm sorry. Training number one, begging off the Irish Warrior, and now trying to fight his way away from the Irish Warrior. Training number 37, rights. told on the tag rope. He's ready to go. Off the ropes is the Irish Warrior. Ducks the line, and being caught with That's a fair hug. And oh, oh, oh. What a spine to the pine. That is even different. And now a knee buster. Irish Warrior breaking down training number one. Now training number one is oh, the oh. one, two, there's a school boy. I was gonna say training number one is, is the head trainee in the Alpha Mac Academy. The most seasoned of the trainees. So does that mean the other two aren't quite ripe yet? Is it I think it's more like baseball, where when you go to spring training, the higher your number, the less chance you have. And now wait a minute! All three members of the Mac attack were tagged in. They're all 37, 143, and the Monster Mac taking on Logan Chambers. And it's 143 against Sterling on the far end of the ring. Are they trying to tie Judge Chambers' hair to the ropes? They are, and Monster Mac oh, got hung 37 up. 37 was going up the ropes. No! Inside the ring, training number 143. I want to be a training 37 guy. Training number 143 is in a bad way. He sees the Irish Warrior and he's, he's gonna get flying. He got thrown to the top turnbuckle. Warrior. Oh, this isn't good. Here comes the potato sack. Oh! Plants 143. There's a melee on the cover. One, two, three. I don't believe it. The winner is at the contest. And Well, the 
Monster Mac Attack Academy were occupied on the outside of the ring and training number 143 ate a potato sack and took the pinfall and once again in Freebird style who will be the tag team champions of the International Men of Honor. This makes it too confusing, Rob. No one can prepare for a match. You don't know which two guys are coming in. Dante's yelling at you. You have a wonderful mustache, sir. I figure if I get on the good side, they won't yell at me like they do at you. I still like you. I don't want to lose you. I know you don't. I don't I, I... Well, training number 37 exits with 143. It's the International Men of Honor. Celebrating the ring. And now, wait a minute. Monster Mac is challenging once again, challenging the International Men of Honor. He's fuming here at the East Providence Rec Center. I think I've heard him uh, yelling well, something anti Semitic. I, I hate to take the International Men of Honor side. They kind of won that clean. Very un Canadian. No There's a lot guys, of diving. No flops. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to go backstage live with Lucy Santana, who is with Devin Blaze. Up oh next, God. the RWA Hype Championship match. And, well, he's Lucy, crazy. Take, Lucy, take it away.